Chicagoans waited in lines at bookstores Friday and called around to other stores in the city as they scrambled to get their hands on a hard copy of Fire and Fury inside the Trump White House. The publisher of the book written by Michael Wolff moved up the release date four days to Friday, and it has topped the chart of Amazon's bestsellers. Those searching for the book, which gives a behind-the-scenes peek at the Donald Trump presidency, turned to Reddit and Twitter to vent about the lack of the book's availability in Chicago stores and ask others on social media for help in finding copies. Let us know if you find it. I really wanted to have the paper book as a sort of permanent remembrance of this insane time, but it's nowhere in sight around here and only $14.99 to get it downloaded to my Kindle right now, one Chicagoan posted on Reddit. Getting it next week is ridiculous. Interest in paper books is waning fast enough without putting off buyers with lame, late distribution. The poster wrote several people were in line outside the Barnes and Noble in the near north neighborhood when it opened on Friday morning but were told the store didn't have the book. At the location in the Lincoln Park community, employees have been fielding calls all day asking about the book. It's been pretty much every other call we've gotten to date, said Alex Zairn. It's crazy the store had only 27 books, and 45 minutes after it opened Friday morning, all were placed on hold, she said. Some people called Thursday night and Friday before the store opened at 9 a.m. to try to get on a reservation list, she said. By 10 a.m., the closest Barnes and Noble store that still had a book was in Rockford, she said. Kate Baller arrived at the Lincoln Park bookstore too late and then called at least a dozen other bookstores in the Chicago area but was unsuccessful. I've been anxiously awaiting the release of the book, said Baller, 26, who lives in Lincoln Park and describes herself as anti-Trump. She expected to wait in a line because of all the media buzz. But I didn't think I'd have to be on a waiting list, she said. If she can't find a book by Sunday, she plans to download it on her Kindle. The Amazon Books store on Southport Avenue in Lakeview was still waiting for its shipment Friday afternoon, said retail associate Austin Green. Everyone is calling, he said. The book was scheduled to be in stock Friday, and now the store is anticipating its arrival this weekend, he said. There's no wait list or holds placed as books will be released on a first-come, first-served basis, he said. The Chicago Public Library ordered 15 copies a few months ago but increased it to 150 copies, said spokesman Patrick Malloy. No word on when the copies will arrive, but there is a lengthy wait list of more than 500 names, he said. On Thursday, President Trump tweeted about the book's author. I authorized zero access to White House, actually turned him down many times, for author of phony book. I never spoke to him for book. Full of lies, misrepresentations and sources that don't exist.